Hey guys, Jim here, and today I'm going to show you how <coughs> to make your own server for MCP. So, um, as you can see, um, my voice changed now because I'm sick again. So, sorry for that. So, let's get started. So, you need to download Pocketmine MP app from Play Store, which is by Pocketmine. Uh, don't use the Mr. Arm Drop one, uh, Pocket Man one because the Mr. Arm on Play Store is the fake one. So, yeah, let's, um, if you come in here, uh, click on the app and it will take you to the version major. Oh, why it can not for me? Maybe the Wi-Fi is slow, so yeah, you get to the version major. Uh, click on the stable version. Um, wait. I need to restart the app. So let's <coughs> go into again. Oh no. Okay, can't slow version. Maybe on my Wi-Fi. So yeah, guys. Um, when you Download the app, click on the app, and it will take you to the version nature and choose the recommend one or the stable one uh, you decide. So after you click it, install, and it will take you to this page. Yeah, which is default is welcome player to my server, something like that, and just change description, whatever. So let's change this. Yeah. And change. Um. Yeah, you can change whatever you want, and you can get <coughs> how many play slots, and you can disable or enable spawn protection, which is used for peaceful spawn plugin. You cannot fight in the area, so uh, click on the advanced to show more world directory, seed type, and stuff, RAM, and whatever like that. So yeah guys, um, this is how, and when you're done, just click save and save. So, at first you need to start server to let it generate. Uh, a world so you can add plugins and stuff and yeah um okay um I got a lot of plugins installed so if you see like this uh, just back and stop the server and go to the plugins and shit and you can search any plugin like um Simple art and uh, other stuff like wall edit art and peaceful spawn and economy and stuff. But um, unfortunately, my Wi-Fi um not working right now. Um, yeah, it said an error occurred. So yeah, after you install plugin, just turn back on to let um, the server uh, load the plugin so yeah you can so many plugins have loaded and yeah so to change stuff you will need um, wait okay to change stuff you will need an editor a file manager go into pocket mine you can see players Plugins and this TMP I don't know, but I use the final developer version, and you can can see world, and you can change this. Um, yeah, as you can see, default game mode is adventure mode. So basically, all things will be at here. Um, yeah, you can change the memory limit, 
description and whatever. So that's basically it. Um, if you want to up yourself, just go to the Pocket Man console and um, do slash up without slash because it already has slash for you. Up your name. Okay, there you go. Yeah, that's how you do it. If you want to clear this uh, text, just click on the bin. And yeah, guys, that's basically it. <coughs> I'm going to turn off now. So if you want to port forward, um, go to your internet and put... Um, wait, let's go to the... Let me show you first. Um, yeah. <coughs> Go to your Wi Fi and hold your Wi Fi network, modify network config, show advanced option, and you can see your IP address and change this to static. And you can see the gateway, which is uh, you need to write it on a website. I mean the browser so let's write that on my browser here quickly and go and at first time you get this um, your default username uh, may be admin and password is admin so that's for my router link 6 um, yeah once you get over here you can just um, go to the application and gaming so don't ask me for other <coughs> router because I don't even know how to use um, the port forward thingy for other console so yeah um, <coughs> you need to port forward by this type just name it whatever you want and this is the default port and change the both to UDP and if you want to someone join your work not the server you can just go for the TCP and this is the IP where you can get by the setting here you can see um, IP address yeah one two like that it will be it always change after you're done, just tick it and save the settings, and you're done. And you just go to what is my IP.com, and yeah, and give this IP to your friends to join. So, and the port is default. If you want a domain, just go check out noip.com so you can override this IP with um, like a domain, something like um, myip.ddns.net, something like that. So yeah guys, so thanks for watching this video, hopefully you enjoy and please click the like button if um, you know how you can make your own server so yeah thank you for watching and goodbye